All right. This actually problem is something I use to help my kids when I do SAT training at night. Um, what you're doing is you're finding the sum of all the even numbers from 1 to 1,000. Very clear by the directions. To do this without having to add up every single even number, you're going to need this formula right here. S sub n equals n over 2 times the quantity of a sub 1 plus a sub n. And what you're really doing is you're finding a partial sum. So you got to break this down into pieces. You got to really just think about this problem. Don't rush into it. Don't confuse yourselves. I mean, the reality is you're really starting at the number 2 and you're adding the next even number and the next even number. So 2, 4, 6 plus uh, dot, 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 plus 996 plus 998 plus 1,000. So you're adding all these things together. Well, there are three important pieces of information you need in order to solve this by using this formula. First, you would need n, a sub 1, and a sub n. Now, a sub 1 and a sub n are actually very easy to find. a sub 1 is the very first term in the sequence, 2. a sub n is the very last term, 1,000. Easy enough. But n, n is actually how many things you're adding together. Now, some people are saying, do I have to count all these things? No you can use logic. For example, obviously I'm using a thousand numbers uh, to pick from. However, I'm only limited to the even ones. And it would make sense that half the numbers from one to a thousand are odd and half the numbers are even. And since we're only finding the even ones, it's safe to say you're only adding 500 of those terms together. So this is um, kind of like a, a trick to, to analyzing a problem without having to really count for yourself. And then from this point, you can just start plugging things in. You'd say, all right, I'm adding 500 terms together. Take this 500, divide it by 2, take the first term, add it to the last term. You're going to get 250 times 1,002. And after you multiply that together, I did it longhand before I did this video, you're going to get 250 five zero zero so that's what you get when you add the first um, excuse me the, all the even numbers from one to a thousand